So I stopped uh, making the other videos that I was making right now to go ahead and come over here and make this video because I feel like it's important to talk to you guys about this and make sure we're all on the same level and uh, just talk about how YouTube is managing to ruin their platform for creators and viewers alike. As many of you know, I started my YouTube channel back in 2012. It's been over six years of me doing YouTube here on this channel. It has been my biggest hobby slash passion for many years now. I have enjoyed pretty much every single minute of doing this but unfortunately as time goes on it's becoming harder and harder for creators and for viewers to actually enjoy youtube now what do i mean when i say that okay a lot of you don't remember og golden era youtube like 2007 to early 2010s like right there on that border some people would argue it stopped around 2009 and i understand why they would say that but you don't remember the days when you could get on YouTube and you could really truly see people be themselves. You might not remember the days on YouTube where you could get on here and you could watch content for hours. You don't remember the days of YouTube where everybody who did this actually could communicate with their subscribers because when you clicked that subscription button, it actually meant something and your content was promoted to that person. You may not remember all of these good things about YouTube. Guys, YouTube has accidentally, I guess, accidentally screwed themselves once again with the creator community. Now, last night there was a tweet, of course. They have all these issues going on with the sub boxes. I know plenty of you were having issues with this too. Trust me, it makes me just as mad that my videos don't show up in your sub box as it does when you try to see my newest content and you can't because YouTube won't promote it to you. It makes me just as mad when you guys tell me, oh, I had notifications on but I didn't get one for this video because in the end I want you guys to see my content there's a reason that I make I don't make it for it to sit on my channel and for people to not be able to see it I don't put it here on YouTube and just hope hey I really hope that YouTube decides not to promote my own video to my viewers I want every single person who is subscribed to my channel and obviously I even want people who aren't subscribed to my channel to have the opportunity to see and watch my videos. Now, unfortunately, YouTube is really, really, really attempting to make sure that this does not happen. And it's not just me. YouTube has now decided that they want to go ahead and mess with the sub boxes, which are already broken. People are being randomly unsubscribed from channels that they're watching. People are not getting videos in their sub boxes. People are not getting notifications. People are having issues logging into their YouTube channel. This website is entirely broken. There is a plethora of issues for the YouTube team to be fixing right now but what are they focused on quote unquote optimizing the sub feed now you might think hey that sounds like a pretty good idea hopefully they go ahead and make it a little bit easier for me to see the cre the content that i want right i want to see my favorite creators first and then obviously i want people who i'm still subscribed to but they're not amongst my favorites to also be there and that's what youtube is trying to pretend that they're doing with this quote unquote optimization with this quote unquote personalized sub feed but what that really means is if you're making content that youtube endorses if you're matching their agenda if you're making child-friendly content if you're making videos where you don't say anything naughty that youtube doesn't like then guess what you'll be at the top of everyone's sub feed who has you subscribed obviously but guess what if you're not aligned with youtube if you're not saying what they want you to say, if you're not making the content that they endorse, you're not going to be at the top of the sub feed. You're not going to be really promoted to your own viewers. There is no real fair shot for you. And that's becoming more and more true every single day on YouTube. See, the sub boxes or the sub feed right now, the way it works is it works in chronological order. The newest uploads generally show up first. Older uploads show up later or lower down on the page. Now, what this allows people to do is it allows them, obviously, to see the newest content first. And this is extremely useful for people who get on YouTube multiple times per day like myself. Believe it or not, I don't only get on YouTube just to check analytics and upload videos and read comments. I also am a huge fan of multiple creators here on the pl on the platform. I love watching other people's YouTube videos. I get on here, I watch iDubs, H3H3, Wang, I watch Birdman, I can't remember if I named him already. There's just so many people here on this, on this platform that I watch. And the chronological order is very helpful for people like me because often the video will show up 
twice, even though I've already seen it, it's still going to show up again, so obviously I don't want to watch the same video twice most of the time. I want to watch the newer videos. But guess what? At this point, now what YouTube's doing is, it doesn't matter if you've already seen that video. It doesn't matter if that video's even good. If it doesn't align with their agenda, it's going to the bottom. And guys, I have a little bit of a feeling that my content is not going to be at the top of your sub boxes because I'm not something that YouTube can market. I'm not something YouTube can promote to make themselves the most money. I'm not something that YouTube can use as an agenda. And if you didn't know, notifications are not notifications anymore. There are like three different tiers. And in fact, when you hit that notification button, you are actually only signing up for occasional notifications. You have to hit that button again, go down the menu, and hit always notify me of new upload. As a matter of fact, please make sure that you've done that because if you don't do that, you might not be seeing my new content from here on out. That's just the truth of it. We don't know what YouTube's gonna do. YouTube is so unpredictable, and YouTube is so horrible to their creators who they can't promote that they are just completely willing to do this and possibly ruin people's livelihoods. Because what people don't understand is obviously we rely on our subscribers for our income. When you have a channel that makes you your revenue, if you're like me, this is your primary source of income, you can't afford for YouTube to take some of your viewers away by deciding, hey, we're not going to promote this person to their own subscriber count. You can't afford for that to happen because if they start doing that to you, you will lose money, and you might not be able to afford to even make YouTube videos anymore. Now, I am blessed enough to have enough subscribers and people watching my content that I could turn my passion into something that makes me enough money to, to, to thrive off of, right? And of course, YouTube had to change that all up too and make sure that smaller creators had a harder time doing this. Of course, it did benefit in some ways, but it also hurt the livelihoods of a lot of people. Even though most of those people weren't making very much, it also destroyed a lot of channels that were on the brim of actually making money here on YouTube and making their, their passion a living. And that has become one of YouTube's central focuses for its creators is turning this into something that can help creators sustain themselves if they so please. So not only does it hurt the finances of your creators when YouTube does things like this by not promoting them, not only does it hurt our channel growth because obviously new subscribers are not seeing our content, they might unsubscribe, subscribers might forget that we're even uploading videos, or if our videos aren't getting promoted, we can hardly get new subscribers because people who aren't already subscribed to the channel aren't seeing videos as often. So not only does it hurt the creator like this, it also hurts the viewer because obviously they're not seeing content that they want to see. Well, I guess they are. They're only seeing a couple people's content, but they're not seeing all the content that they really want. I don't understand why YouTube has this habit where they decide, hey, this issue isn't really broken but it's not really along with our agenda, therefore, let's completely screw creators over. YouTube, for years now, has been so anti-creator and so toxic to the creator community that people have straight up quit their passions. People have straight up quit because they don't want to deal with it anymore. And YouTube doesn't care, and you think that they would because, let's be honest, if it wasn't for people like me, if it wasn't for creators like me driving them ads, YouTube would not make any money. The site's already not very profitable for YouTube, if at all. Imagine how much of a cash-bleeding piece of garbage it would be if we weren't here putting content out all the time, getting ads ran up for YouTube, making them money, getting people on their website to watch content. If it weren't for us making content, YouTube wouldn't be anything. And if it weren't for people like you watching our content, we wouldn't be anything. YouTube wouldn't be anything. It, in the end, it's all about satisfying creators and satisfying viewers. If you satisfy the creators, usually you can satisfy the viewers because the creators can make the content that they want and their viewers are generally people who like the creator's content to begin with. But if you keep screwing over the creators, not only are we going to leave for competitive websites like Twitch and any other future YouTube quote-unquote that comes up, but your viewers are going to also. YouTube, don't feel like like you're invincible. Really, don't feel like you're just this big invincible behemoth that will not go down. You are not the first website that gained this popularity and you will certainly not be the last. Guys, in direct response to this, 
Not only am I creating my own website that I will upload my content onto as well, and also upload exclusive content onto, I also encourage other creators to do the same thing. Now, I'm not quitting YouTube, obviously, this is still my main priority, but future videos that get uploaded will also be available on that platform, that way, say you don't get your video on this, you don't get the notification here on YouTube, you can always check the website. There's always going to be new content on that. You will see every single video from here on out as long as I keep updating the website, I don't know if it's going to fail or not, but as long as the website keeps getting updated, there's going to be a new video on there every single time I upload. It'll be on the videos tab. On top of that, there will be exclusive content on the website like blogs, game reviews, other articles, and videos over there, and it'll just be a hub where you guys can come and see everything about Optimus. Now, this website is still in construction, but I do have a very basic version of it up right now. It is on the screen right now, and it is also linked at the top of the description. Guys, bookmark that website, because I have a feeling here very soon, if YouTube keeps going the way that it is, you're gonna have a really hard time finding my content in your notifications and in your sub boxes. And while I'm not quitting YouTube, this is going to help give me more security by making sure my videos can be seen by more people. And it's also giving you guys the ability to find my content easier than ever. Because, I mean, you guys have a guaranteed spot to find it. You would think YouTube would be that guaranteed spot, but it just isn't anymore. Anyways, guys, thank you for watching. Thank you for all your continued support. This has been an entirely rough day, I guess, for YouTube. Because there's plenty of outspoken creators talking about this. And they just don't seem to understand. They don't seem to get it. They don't understand us, and that's fine. It's whatever, guys. www.optimiststudios.org is now live. There will be channel listings, videos, reviews, and a blog on there. So, guys, go bookmark that. Make sure you follow that website. I will be updating it consistently, and it is now my second quote-unquote home. Guys, thank you for watching. If you did enjoy, make sure to drop a like. Subscribe if you're new around here. Please turn on your notifications for always. Make sure you're seeing all my new content. Follow me on Twitter for memes, thoughts, and updates. Go see the website below, and also join the Discord below for speaking to me and my other fans. And until my next video, guys, this is Optimus, hoping YouTube doesn't decide that I'm not worthy of being promoted to my own subscribers, and signing out.